Sometimes when using the time clock, staff members forget to punch out at the end of the day. So we've built in a feature that allows you to edit the end time for their shift so that you can always clock them out if you know their hours. That way your payroll is up to date and it's accurate. To do so, you're going to want to access your reports, then staff time clock, and that's going to pull you up to the page that we see on the screen here. And then we go down to the employee that you want to edit their end time. As you can see here, we have a start time of 914 in the morning and it's saying till now because they're still working technically. However, if they've already gone home for the day and they just forgot to punch out, you can always edit the end time by clicking end time and then choosing the time that they clocked out at. So let's just say they clocked out at 4 p.m. Then we hit save and that's going to now update 914 till 4 p.m. And so what this means is that in your reports now, it shows, I just refreshed the page just to update the totals. It shows that they worked six hours, 45 minutes. Their total work hours shows below here in case they have break time and stuff like that as well. And then if we scroll down, it's now going to show in their total work time, six hours, 45 minutes. Total days worked is one. So you're going to see that there. And that'll keep track of uh, their breaks and everything like that as well. So it's a quick way that you can edit one of the records if an employee forgets to punch out. It happens from time to time all at our shop. We do encourage them to stay vigilant and make sure that they do it before they leave for the day. However, sometimes things happen and uh, it falls through the cracks. So this way you can quickly edit the end time and it'll keep your books up to date. Makes payroll a breeze. All right.